Hi. We're going to uh, the water park today, Hurricane Harbor. I just pulled into our Target, which I think of Nick and Lena every time I go to now because of that engagement video. Bye. Check it out, yo. A Batman swimsuit, obviously. I got this cool shark one. I got the fish, fishy one for lanner. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Hurricane Harbor, baby. And then a couple more roller coasters. Six Flags got this thing today for the season pass holders for an hour after they closed the park. So it's exclusive like rides on roller coasters. I think I'm gonna step it up and ride the next, you know, scary ones today. We'll see. But we get to do the water park, which was closed on my birthday, so I'm excited about that. God damn, I might need a fucking haircut soon, huh? <laughs> Starting to look like a girl here. Maybe the fucking, I'll grow it to my ass. Swing my hair around like Al. And if hope dies. No? Yeah? No? See you from the park. Where are we going? The water park. What do you think of your towel? Uh, it's cool. What are we going to do after the park, water park? You got a roller coaster. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm really excited. Woo! Here. Yeah, that's right. Give Daddy his card back. So here we are, day two. Six Flags Magic Mountain. We're gonna hit this water park first. Colossus is now forward again. That's closing in August. That's the roller coaster that was on the step-by-step. -step. I think it's the oldest wooden roller coaster in the US. And they're closing it. Uh, one above that is the Goliath, which I am terrified of. And there's the Superman with the Lex Luthor death drop next to it. See that? That one's gonna be a piece of cake. That one? I don't know. Hello. We're not taking the camera into the water park. And this pavement is very hot. Let's check out my bathing suit. I love that Beyonce. Right, What's up, B? Okay, we're leaving. I'm gonna flip the camera out and show you what we did first. There's there's a tower. What are you doing for? So you go up the stairs and there's the new bonsai pipelines. One of them's moderate and the other one's max throw. You go straight down. And what happens is the water slides instead of just you know, going over and you go, there's a platform and they shut the tube so you're locked in and then you, you get count down, the floor comes out from under you and you fall down. Let me show you these. Doesn't look that high, especially from the ground. So we grew pretty big balls. You can see it from the ground, it arches down, almost halfway down, but once you're up there, it seems like a much larger drop. Definitely intense, definitely woke me right up, but it was really fun. If I didn't conquer those roller coasters last time, I probably never would have done this. I would have chickened out too. And the little ass girl. And then we went on that funnel one, which I, I liked. But we we did that Colossus roller coaster last time. We heard the smaller white one, and it's taller than both. So what happened? I lost my imaginary balls I had. Oh no, I got scared, and I had an anxiety attack for the first time, and I can't breathe. And then I was trying to hold my breath because I thought I was like, going to end up in a pool of water. I couldn't see in that tunnel. I was like freaking claustrophobic. Well, it's, it, the black you got on the black one though, after you didn't go on the blue pipeline. Yeah, when I was in the was blue one, too? supposedly I heard my own heartbeat and I thought it was the radio. So apparently I'm going fucking nuts. And then I thought, oh, I'm just going to go down the tunnel. So I just walked right over and went phew, right down it like it was nothing. Next thing I know, I'm freaking out. Going, <gasps> <gasps> yeah, I thought I was going to die. So now you know what a panic attack feels like when we're in line for a roller coaster for me. Yes, now I know. So I did the blue one and because she freaked out so bad. I didn't have a problem telling the guys. Like I was holding the door open for a minute. I was like, wait, wait. 
I'm like, nah, it's fine, bro. I'm like, I don't know. She, I've never seen her get scared, so it's kind of making me a little nervous, but I did it. But it was funny because when I was holding, you know, they put you in position. As soon as it went, my, my arms came up and I had to pull them back down. Like, it drops pretty intense. It was awesome, though. She now knows how it feels every time I ride a roller coaster, but on my birthday when we came here, I just did it. My buddy Nick Matson has taught me a couple of things, and one of his texts just stuck in my head. It's just one of those things you don't look at, you don't worry about it until you're locked in. And then, you know, it's too late, so you might as well try to have fun. So, second trip was nice. We did two water slides. We've been here a few hours. I mean, we had to wait pretty long wait times, which is pretty stupid. It's not like back home. They stop you, so the stairs stay clear, and they let a certain amount of people go at one time. It's stupid, but whatever. Round two. Man wants to try some coasters. The stars have made the magical sky. Maybe impacting that.